TikTok. I didn't even realize that you could look at TikToks uh, on a computer. I thought it was a mobile only thing. Uh, but because it's on the computer, guys, I'm going to be able to make a sick video about my favorite TikToker. And this guy, okay, I want everyone to <laughs> not make fun of him. He's one of my favorite TikTokers, to be honest. <laughs> uh, but pretty much what he does is he spends his life responding to people's questions. Now, to be honest, this guy seems like quite a nice guy. He's very humble. And he lives off benefits, so I actually kind of feel bad for him. He's also a heavy smoker. And because of that, he doesn't think he's going to live more than 10 years, uh, which is really sad. I don't I don't even know if I would be able to find that TikTok where he replies with that very morbid reply. Uh, but that's what he said. The one thing I hate about TikTok is the comments. Let's say you're a YouTuber, right? If you're fat, most of the comments you're going to get, the top comments, are not going to be making fun of your obesity your huge body uh but with tiktok it's the opposite like literally the worst comments seem to go to the top they seem to float which is really weird and is kind of toxic for a lot of tiktok creators but let's take a look at nicholas uh so yeah i want to advertise his tiktok he's a really nice guy uh smash like on this video if you do enjoy it and also subscribe to the channel if you're new today i make phenomenal videos you're about 10 I'm only going to be engaged to a 10 year old and I'm married to my wife. No, no, go away. <laughs> Firstly, the song. The song is honestly so like upbeat and like fast paced, got a high tempo. And he's just like in outrage. <laughs> he's just speaking in absolute outrage over the music. But secondly, I oh, swear he nice changes filter. But look, it's kind of like uh, the contrast is too high. Like, he's angry, mid-rant, he still changes the filter. Uh, Nicholas wants to look good at all times. Look at this. You're about 10. I'm only going to be engaged to a 10-year-old and I'm married to my wife. No, no, go away. Oh, dear, nice try. You're I love it how he just doesn't recognise it's a joke at all. And to be honest, I kind of feel bad for Nicholas. Because <laughs> he, he shouldn't be on TikTok, like, realistically. <laughs> oh, my God. Jack Anthony comments a really nice comment. Uh, everyone wants to be uh, you because you're a hero, mate. I wonder how he's going to reply to that. Oh, no, I'm not a hero. I'm just a man answering your questions. Oh, no, I'm... This guy. He's so nice. Like, he, he seems like a really genuine guy. Like, he does get angry at jokes that are clearly... Uh, well, at comments that are clearly jokes. But he is genuinely a nice guy. He just doesn't understand it. Like, that's it, really. Do you prefer baths or showers? This is a very deep question. I wonder how Nicholas responds. Not going to be mean, but I don't think he can fit in the bath. Like, Nicholas is a big guy. I'm not saying he's fat. He's just he's just well built. He's very mus muscly. Unfortunately, at the moment, I have to have showers. I mean, I'd love to, I'd love to have a good soak in the bath because I do miss having a good soak in the bath where you can just lay there, you know, and relax for a while. But unfortunately, at the moment, I have to have a shower because I cannot get in a bath. I promise I did not watch his TikTok before I reacted to it. Now I feel bad. <laughs> I was literally expecting him to go, oh, I love a good bath. And then my joke would have just been a joke. I didn't realise I was actually spitting facts. God dang it, this is really sad. And again, the music is so happy. And he's literally trying to explain how he got fit in the bath. It's really tragic. But I, I, I really, 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 really... And the music's like... Good laugh, to be honest, but Guys, I just can't fit in the bath. I really miss them. what I'm used to. Okay. That's sad if you can't get in the bath. I wish you could. <laughs> what? Believe me, I'd love to be out of the bath. Believe me, I'd just, you know. Uh, when I lived in... Literally, he's about to cry about this. Like, literally, people are just asking him really light-hearted questions. Oh, do you prefer, you know, a bath or a shower? And he's literally rubbing his eyes. I feel so bad for Nicholas. I did have a bath. And, uh... I mean, to be fair, I had a very good social worker who, who got me this uh, bath lift thing. And, uh, you know, I'm going to step you got on it and it took you down in the bath gradually and up. You know, and it was really good because it made, made it level. Uh, bath buckle thing, what it's called now. It's, it's so you used to have a device which put him in the bath, like, comfortably. I, I don't get what he's on about. Okay, he just is a nice guy. Like, he's so honest. Like... Obviously, that might be seen as kind of an embarrassing thing. You physically can't get into the bath. 
But he's actually elaborating on why he can't get in the bath. And on top of that, how he used to be able to get in the bath. Fantastic. Uh, let's see another question. Um, someone put your address, mate. The amusing thing is, it's not my address, Scotty. But I keep blocking them and they keep creating new accounts putting my address, but it's not my address. That's the funny thing about it. It's not my address. So... You know, I don't know, I don't know what the matter with me, Scotty. They're just doing my editing, to be honest. They keep... I really don't get why people actually hate on this guy. Like, they, they try to, I mean, dox him, effectively. It's just, it's just not fair, or really scare him. So for example, if his fans are saying, well, not really fans, but haters, if they're saying to him, oh, we know your address, like, it must be quite threatening. At the end of the day, this guy, he's not doing anything wrong at all. Like, I don't get it. Your wife has been messaging my uncle. Why would you comment that? I just don't get it. Like, it's all these teenagers that are just trying so hard to be funny. I don't know why I keep calling them teenagers, because I am a teenager. But it's just these goddamn GCSE students. They're just such idiots. Like, that sounds even worse, to be honest. No, it's just these people who are, like, 15. Like, they're just so hateful for no reason. Like, my uncle was holding her hand down the pub the other day, mate. I know a lot of people are probably joking. I mean, they are clearly joking. But Nicholas is not going to understand that, you know. He takes everything seriously. It's not really fair to maybe annoy him in this way. Because he's deep. Maybe he's a deep insecurity of his. I don't know. His wife is pretty hot, to be honest. You mean your uncle wishes my wife was pretty There we go, Nicholas. Yes. Because my wife is very beautiful. She so is. they wish she was messaging, but she's not. You that was a good reply, though. Uh, that breathing is not the sound of healthy. Lol, I'm sorry. Or well, now Nicholas is going to reply to that. That's because I'm not healthy. That's why I'm... Oh, the music. <laughs> nee, nee. Guys, I'm going to die soon. Nee, nee. <laughs> literally literally listen, to the, listen to the music in the background. That's because I'm not healthy. That's why I breathe heavy. Guys, I'm going to be dying soon. <laughs> that's Oh, that's not very good. I like the music. It's just... <laughs> oh, my God. What? Guys, I'm quitting TikTok because of all the hate towards me. And my lovely wife is getting too much. Bye, guys. Are you joking me? Three hours ago, he quit. What? <clears throat> oh, because people are commenting stuff like, how many kids are there in your shed, lad? There's nothing wrong with obviously having a bit of a harmless joke with someone. But like, if they can't take the joke and then you're flat out just saying things that are trying to trigger him. Like in that manner, like saying that he's got kids in his basement. Like, that's so harsh. And it's just sad. It's not even funny. Oh, he actually replied to it. Oh, no. You've got 31,000 followers. Are you really that desperate for my attention? Are you that sad and lonely you have to insult others? That's actually a good comeback, you know. And yet you've got 31,000 followers. You must have one very sad life. 31,000 followers. And you could get shut down for online abuse and bullying. And it's probably taking you a long time to build them up. So stop it. Because if I was to report you for harassment and online bullying, you'd get shut down. And then... To be fair, Nicholas, he's so like... He's so genuine, like he's actually, he's not even just reporting this prick, he's actually like, uh, trying to like, make him think twice. And then you have Cam here, you didn't answer the question though, bit suspicious. Like, there's nothing wrong with making fun of people, like obviously, but when someone is literally getting triggered and bullied, like, look, there's more comments like, I think you got my cousin in the shed, though. Can I have him back? Like, it's just not fair. Like, literally, look at Cap. Look at this guy. This guy is taking the rip out of someone else. Look at him. He's he's probably five foot four, to be honest. Look at him. Like, he's probably his friend as well. He's probably insecure. Probably didn't even show his face. <laughs> Fantastic. But, like, who was the guy who commented that? This guy's got 31,000 followers. Oh, he just makes memes of other people and other things. Oh. But, like, that's the problem with TikTok. It just gives fame to the wrong types of people. It really 
This was the last TikTok that he made. I can't believe he left. Oh, no, he didn't. 15 minutes ago, he made a TikTok. Okay, so you must be back. I don't even know. I saw your wife walking through Canterbury with a man that wasn't you. Th people are so horrible to this guy. I don't get it. Sort of thing a five-year-old would say, mate. Oh, yeah, look at your videos. You're about five, isn't ya? So what he does is if someone hates on him, he will just look at their TikTok account and he will kind of insult them back. Which, I, I, there's nothing wrong with that. But like, I think, honestly, I want Nicholas to watch this video. I really do. If people are hating you, just ignore the comments. Like, you're just feeding these haters. And the thing is, right, is there's people like me who I genuinely like to see this guy respond to nice questions. Like, let me show you guys how good this guy is when it comes to normal normal questions so this is someone's birthday <laughs> i think uh 21. I wish I was 21. oh no someone said that he's 21. he must have asked what age do you think i am <laughs> i wish i was 21. oh you always crack me up young lady every time you come in you crack me up you are brilliant oh fair play this lady here is brilliant She's so funny he's a nice guy it's just funny how he's literally there like, you just crap me up, you're so funny, ha 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 ha. And then he goes to turn it off, he's like, with the deadpan face. <laughs> Let's see that again. Oh, you always crap me up, young lady. Every time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this guy's so, like, this guy's just genuine. Like, that's the thing, right? Do you like peanut butter? That's not a controversial question. Hopefully he's going to respond to that in a positive manner. Yeah, peanut butter. Yeah, I do. I like peanut butter. If you couldn't tell that Nicholas likes peanut butter, he did say yes in multiple different ways, multiple times. So, yeah. Peanut. So he says yes. Yeah, I do. Yep. I like peanut butter. Three. Ooh. Just in case you guys didn't think he liked peanut butter, he reaffirmed everyone that he does like peanut butter three times. Nick, do you think that the trolls are hating because you are a legend? Come on, whoever this is. The reason who is this guy? This guy's a nice guy. Like, flipping it, you're a legend, okay? Thank you for being nice to this guy. The reason they're hating so much is because I'm old. And I've become very, very viral on TikTok. I mean, I don't see myself as a legend or anything like that. Um, but, yeah, to be honest, you know... Oh, nice. Music. My friend's just telling me what he's got for dinner tonight. He's got cottage pie. Look at him. Well, I've cottage pie. My man is talking to one of his friends about what he's having for dinner. And he, his friend replies, cottage pie. That's what he's having for dinner. This guy, that, he responds by saying, lucky him. This guy, I don't get how people can hate on him. Like, he's, he genuinely is a nice guy. Yeah, he's a bit goofy. But I think everyone needs to be a bit goofy. Like, if you're not goofy, you're just boring. So this is a TikTok in which he reacts to his toast. <laughs> Eggs on toast. I, what does the red inhaler do? I have a brown inhaler. I have asthma, if you guys didn't know. Inhaler. What does that do? Red inhaler. I, I didn't even know there was a red one. What is all this crap about? I literally just searched red inhaler and it comes up with a flipping... Uh, British Journal of General Practice article. What? Oh, it's so, so. Oh, I just want to know what the red inhaler does. Look at this guy. Look how nice this guy is. Two of his fans recognize him. Look how happy this guy is. Hello, everybody. Hey, hello, everybody. Hey, I was just about to say this guy really cares about his fans, but. The way that he ended that was a little bit, a little bit suspect. Come on, Nick. Hey, hello, everybody. There you go. <laughs> Yay, hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Yeah, hello, everybody. I love everyone. Woo! Okay, there's, there's your clip done. Okay. <laughs> God's sake, Nicholas. Uh. Oh. And then he's on the bus. He's on the bus. He's got his mask on, at least. COVID-19. To be honest, I don't get why he's out. I think he has serious uh, breathing problems. I really hope he doesn't contract COVID-19. I genuinely hope. I mean, obviously, I hope that most people, well, pretty much everyone doesn't die from it. But I hope he keeps in as much as he can, you know? 
Wait, are you the fridge? I, I'm confused. When I go to the fridge for the thousand, ten thousandth time, then she's looking into the fridge. Hello, and, then, hello. and then Nicholas is saying hello. I'm now where I'm supposed to be. I think Nicholas might question his gender. He might be a fridge. And I don't get why people are hating on that. I mean, they're not hating on the fact that he's a fridge. They're more hating on him in general. But guys, he might have insecurities. Deep down, he might be a fridge. I like the view. You do? Yes. You're my best view. <laughs> Nicholas, that was a bit bad. Okay, come on, Nicholas. You can do better than that. Uh, I felt like that was a bit low energy from you. Okay, now he's outside. Whoa, I've not seen this Maybe before. Boy. Hello, 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 hello. Here is my four wheel walk. How are you? This when I go out. I just thought you'd need to know because I get very out of breath when I'm walking. Now I'm off out now and I won't get far and I'll be sitting, sitting down on the way. I hope you'll have a fantastic afternoon and I will be back after I'm in the BM. Thank you. Peace. This guy. This guy is such a nice guy. Like he's literally telling people, guys, I'm gonna be gone for a bit. I'll I'll be back to all of you after I've been to BM. This guy is literally a true a true guy, like, I don't get how people can actually hate on him so much. He's so wholesome, as this person commented as well. Like, genuinely, uh, if you if you look at TikTok, if, you, if you're if you a TikTok user, follow this guy. Genuinely support his content. Seems like such a nice guy, really. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I really hope he doesn't come out uh, as a convicted paedophile, and then I'm in trouble because I've advocated uh, supporting a paedophile. <laughs> Let's hope that doesn't happen. But there, it won't happen. It's fine. Thanks for watching my video. Smash like. Right now, if you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel if you're new today. I'll be seeing you guys later. Goodbye.